Hi there, Pisces. It's my lady, and I'm here to bring you your Just Because reading. Just Because. How are you? Welcome back. So happy to have you back. I'm just shuffling your cards here. And then in a little bit, we're going to be pulling out. We're going to go, go with these because they came up face first. Um, in a little bit, we're going to go ahead and grab um, any um, angel wisdom uh, cards here for you. Whatever the angel wants to communicate with you. And then I have some clarifying cards as well as some stones that I want to bring out uh, for your Just Because reading. So let's go ahead and jump into this reading for you. I'm going to wait to pull up some more cards here. Wait for some cards to fall out here. That one wants to come out. See what else we come up with don't forget to share like and subscribe let me know what you think about this reading keep in mind this is a general reading so not everything will resonate and if it doesn't leave it for another pisces right all right so let's see what comes up here so far these three i'm gonna go with so pisces have you been feeling bound all right have you been feeling like um you know um, you want to help but you can't um, there's work there's some work that was put in is what I'm showing here um, um, and I'm showing um, some kind of decision that was made all right uh, the decision that was made was you were very happy and content with it um, as there's a change like something of leaving something or moving away from something um you are highly intuitive right now okay so your your intuition is on point and what have been what moved away could have been this um you know this uh this here where i'm showing the two people here where there was uh, love and mutual respect and there was a lot of happiness here understanding um commitment uh partnership um this is what i'm showing here okay something i feel like you put a lot of work into you know you know when you fight for something that you want and you're not going to stop fighting because it's yours or because no one's going to take that away or no one's going to come in between you and that other person. That's what. That's the way I'm seeing it. That's how I'm feeling it. It's like you're not going to stop fighting for it. It's yours and no one's going to take that away from you. What else do I see here for you? Um, I'm feeling like, you know, you being blindfolded not seeing things for what they are a decision that you needed to make all right you having all the tools that you need to make that decision so it's i feel like you have all the facts all the the truth the thing anything that you needed to know and and um to in order for you to make that decision okay um it may have to do with um wow interesting so I'm showing here this can be you, this Queen of Cups here, or a water sign, which is the um, Cancer, um, Scorpio, or Pisces. And she's looking in at this King of Swords. The King of Swords can be an air sign, uh, which is uh, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, okay? And it's interesting enough here with this Wheel of a Fortune, you know, I feel like there was like some kind of a karmic situation because it's right underneath the making the decision here. Um, do you see how this Wheel of the Fortune is? Meaning, you know, you have uh, two here, this king and queen and they're kicking somebody off there <laughs> meaning they do not belong in this here so no more third party situation no more okay that's how i feel it i feel like you were blindfolded to that like you weren't seeing things for what they are but you weren't giving up you're saying oh no she is not gonna have my man or he is not he, uh he is not gonna have my woman that's how i'm seeing it pisces um all right, I'm seeing change, I'm seeing movement, I'm seeing hope. Uh, this is what I'm showing here. Oh, the lover's card. Hey, 
you know this can't be a love reading without a lover's card all right i'm showing something that you can be completely secure about i feel this um this emperor as taking the lead all right i'm showing that you need to have faith and you need to have um patience okay and know that this person here all right is um will have patience with you i want to say or you should have patience with them okay you're not letting go of him or he's not letting go of you that's what i'm showing there so i kind of feel like yeah they may have messed up but they're not letting go they're going to be there they are not they're very hopeful and they're you know they have a lot to think about i see there it's really you know uh, messing with their with their with their head you know they're it's really coming down to man i really messed up that's what i'm showing here wow okay um and wow look at this infidelity uh, breakup you know, someone not seeing you, not valuing valuing you. You know what I'm saying? Giving you your worth, Pisces. You know, so that there can be happiness and prosperity. All right, because there has to be movement. There has to be change here, and you got infidelity twice here. Like, come on now. Exactly. You know, that's why I put these two decks, you know, together because I want it to give me emphasis here. I want it to be able to tell me so that it stands out in the reading so that I can. Uh, you know, uh, let you know what I see here. All right. That is what I'm showing for you, Pisces. Let's find out what the, what the angels want to tell you. I got these cards here and we're going to talk about this. Okay. Okay. And okay. All right. So the first one we're talking about is this pentacles queen. All right. She's generous, practical, uh, she is uh, gracious she is materialistic the ability to make another anything more beautiful a love of family and home be practical about how you proceed um, a love of art and beauty a sensible approach all right she is an earth sign the earth sign is um can be um can be Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. And the next card that it came up for you is uh, release. Okay. Wow. Okay. So that that's the ending that leads to new beginnings. The need to release situations or people that hold you back. Spiritual transformation. Interesting. That's your angel speaking to you. You know, there's a release here that's needed. What is it? You know, I mean, how how much can you, you know, how, how much can you take is what I want to, not what I'm asking here, all right? And this other one here is unfold, unfounded fear, expecting the worst, creating self-fulfillment prophecies, allowing worry to grow out of proportion to the situation, sleepless nights, refocus your thoughts. Come on, Pisces. Enthusiastic, optimistic, creative, and patient news of exciting opportunities allowing your creativity to soar do things that fuel your passions finish what you start pisces okay all right let's go find out what um what stones you have that come up for you here we go all right let's pull them up oh i got one more here we go perfect let's go ahead and talk about this so then here we go so what do i have here for you pisces i have the i have the uh, defense breaking down of boundaries force all right i have um i have creativities awakening growth opening self-knowledge vision all right what else do i have here for you i have sharing hospitality blessings exchanging of oaths Ooh, generosity personal relationships personal relationship to work on all right all right pisces and that's what i have for you just because reading bye bye